Lignin is a resource that's widely available, but it's not utilized very much. And there's a lot of things that can potentially be made from it, but we just don't know what are the best components right now. And the reason we want to understand this is because um, when we break lign lignin apart into smaller pieces, um, it, it forms a lot of different things. But we want to understand what we actually really want. And so we're starting from the other direction. So let's make what we really want and see how it, how it makes special surfaces, uh, coatings, um, how it interacts with cells. And that way when we take real lignin, we have a, 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 something to shoot for. Through that, I could uh, study the interactions of lignin dimers with lipid bilayers, and I found out that some of the dimers, not all of them, penetrate into the bilayer. So the bilayer is kind of like a cell membrane, and the fact that lignin penetra penetrates into the cell membrane is uh, something really interesting in terms of uh, getting antibacterials or antimicrobials from lignin. So there are potentially a lot of valuable products that can come out of utilizing lignin better. We work with graduate students, we work with undergraduates. Um, it's an exciting project for them because they recognize uh, the novelty of what we're doing, um, the opportunity to work across disciplines with, with chemistry, um, with biosystems and ag, and with LSU who has a completely different set of, of skills. And so it's, it's a great opportunity for everyone. I'm able to meet the students from another university, Louisiana State University, and collaborate with them and get to know other students. And professors is, is really good, and I would suggest this to any student. And I find it to be very interesting. I work more with inorganic materials, so I've learned about how lignin is produced by plants, how it's broken down after we harvest the plants, and then what we can do with them. So it's taken me into new directions that I wouldn't have necessarily gone on my own. And I think that this has opened up new kinds of, of uh, opportunities. We, we have new equipment and new techniques. By looking at how LSU uses these techniques, we, can, we think about how to use surfaces in ways we hadn't thought of before. Like we wouldn't have gravitated toward cancer, stem cells. And I think we've challenged them to think about um, how the materials that they make can be used differently. The problem gets more exciting as we start to get more information on, these, on this lignin. I have uh, the chance to work with so many equipments and to uh, get familiar with so many techniques and uh, I'm sure that this will be useful for my future career and it's an interesting project and uh, since it's about plants and plants are everywhere so this research is, is fun. I mean this, t this is a fun team, it's a fun project. And I love that it's going to give our students so many opportunities because they're on the ground level of this, but I love what it, how it could transform the science of, of lignin. Everything that we waste has a potential to be used.